power. Ay na, titikman ko yung spicy coconut gelato kasama yung bagoong. I'm a the self for po proclaimed Sealy King from Makati. That's like Sealy Langit. Some water? <coughs> 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 I've never tasted something so spicy like this on Bogboy, bro. Why don't you down it? Sile 1, Chongo 0. Yung Sile King, kumain siya ng plus 300. Paano ba? Parang imposible yan. Pusok pa tako mamaya. Patay ko sa Jorbax. Okay. Good. God, more puff. There's Sealy everywhere. It's like my nightmare. Not again! <laughs> Patai Giatai. <laughs> Lila restaurant. Uh, we're gonna try out some of the hottest modern Bicolano food dito in the area. Oh my god, look at that. Just when I did pan contra yung sile. Ikanga in Biko Makaon Nakita. And also, dito sa Pulangi, makun nakita. Diba? Cheers! Oh, ika nga, chipo. Cheers! 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 Cheers. <laughs> What's this? So these chili, sealy peppers are back. Maybe they're stuffed with cheese or meat or something. It looks like adobo. I think that's what that chicken is, adobo and bananas. And then we got some vegetables, gulai and the bamboo. Laing, which is one of my favorite foods. And we have Beagle Express made from squid. Now that's gonna be a first. That looks interesting. Why is it called Beagle Express? It's named after the train that used to go across Beagle. So it's called the Beagle Express. The train is called Beagle Express. Then they made these food along the train station. Fun fact. I have the kind of fish patty, adobo, hot chili pepper popper, Beagle Express na, and the lae. So I'm gonna try these chili poppers. They're like big chilies stuffed with picolam. Champagne, you have to make sao sao in the suka. 
chili medyo cheesy. Now, it's just among a favorite kung pagkain the Filipino food. We have the laing, which is kind of like the what's it, what was it called, Kanina? Pinanga. Pinanga. Ping. It's kind of like the pinanga Kanina. It's mostly made of gabi leaves mixed with some gata, and there's sile all over it too. Mm. Wow. Now this is interesting. We got Beagle Express, but it's pusit. I've never had Beagle Express na pusit. I've only had Beagle Express na baboy. So this is cool. Healthy option, deba. I love pusit. What are my artichokes or bagong in it with a weird kick, huh? Now these like mini patties. Apparently they're ista. They're like the smallest. They're the smallest commercial fish, yeah. They're like anchovies times a hundred small, if that makes sense. In a patty. Do you make salsa or you just eat it as is? It's amazing. It doesn't even taste like fish, actually. You can taste garlic and butter, this luyang taste to it. You can taste some ginger, but for the most part, it almost tastes like a chicken patty of some sort or something. I don't know. It kind of tastes like alligator or guaya, if you've ever had that before. I don't buy it. Is that duguan? Pancet with the duguan. So you mix the dinuguan and the pancit. Yes. Interesting. Dinuguan, for those who don't know, is pig's blood. And they mix that with pasta, basically. Oh. Now here we have the adobo. I think it's adobo. I don't think it's adobo. <coughs> it's really good. <coughs> the silly is starting to get in my lalamuna. <coughs> Everything I've eaten here, I think it's a young pinaka favorito kong salahat is one the laing, and then two these small fish things which is called sinarapan. And the sasarapan ako sa sinarapan. Power. And now uh, dito na yung panghimagas. Ika nga, it's never a bad time for panghimagas. So this here is their dessert. It's the Beagle Express dessert. And it's pretty crazy. It's spicy coconut gelato with bagoong on top. Bagoong for yung mga banyagas who don't know. Bagoong's basically like this really strong smelling fermented shrimp paste. It's pretty interesting to mix, you know, this like strong fishy type of fermented paste with spicy coconut ice cream. I'm excited. It's always good to try new things, diba? Power. I know. Titik man ko yung spicy coconut gelato kasama yung bagoong. It's like really good gelato, coconut ice cream, and then there's just a salty, fishy tang in it. But I like it. It's different. It really sticks on the tip of your tongue. But it's really gourmet. There's nothing I can relate this to. Now the whole pasta with pig's blood is not really my thing, but you gotta try it. I mean, I've never tried it before, so let's go. Pancit with dinaguan. Thank you. Blood. You need to try it. You put your life. I might be biased, but I really don't like dinaguan because this one time I was on a show on Motorcycle Diaries and then they made me kill the pigs and then I had to eat them after and it was dinaguan. I can I could like taste the live pig and like the fear in it. I don't know. It brings back a traumatic experiences. So good. I have clips of this. I don't know if I want to show you guys it. I won't show you guys it. <laughs> they bludgered the pigs to death at the slaughterhouses. It's terrible. So hot. Anyway, back to the next food. I'm sticking more with the uh, Beagle Express pussy and the laing.
Lila, by the way, gusto ko lang sabihin, salamat talaga sa lahat ng mga napakasarap ng pagkain. Malani nam nam talaga yan. I loved it. I'd recommend everything there. Even the spicy coconut bogoong ice cream thing. Like, although it was weird, I liked it. And regarding the dinagoan, it wasn't the restaurant's fault. Basta, I don't eat dinagoan, no matter what. So, that doesn't count. I was biased there. Last thing I just want to say is thank you to Manila Man. I forgot to give credit to Manila Man Productions who did all the drone shots, all the A7, and nearly every shot that's not me talking to the camera. Gio Puyat, Wakung Mapuyat, Abby, Javi, all you guys, thank you. Also, if you guys want to see the video that Manila Man made, this was for Globe, it's all linked below. But I still have like three or four more episodes of this, so if you can wait until this is done, unless you want it to spoil, but yeah, it's linked below. Go check out the video Manila Man made with Globe with me for this Beagle series. That's why we went here. Okay, bye. Oh, one more thing. Where should my next travel vlog be? Comment below. A lot of people are saying Bacolod. A lot of people are saying Calabana. Cala,